Our other big story tonight, police in Norfolk under the microscope again after a shooting involving officers. This time the person was a teen. Ten on your side was there. Just moments after the incident on Maltby Avenue, police say they were forced to fire on a 15-year-old who's accused of stabbing his mother, then set fire to their apartment. There's a lot going on with this story, and our Matt Gregory has an update for us. Matt? Yeah, the mother is in critical condition right now. This is the apartment that neighbors say she and her son shared together. You can see it's been boarded up now after the fire. But police also say this was the scene of a violent attack early this morning. Early Wednesday morning, police, fire, and paramedics converged on Maltby Avenue. By the time I put on my shirt to come out the door, I seen all the police the rescue squads, the fire wagons. Across the street from Annie Davis, a fire roared inside this apartment. The kitchen you know, was on fire, then you could just see all the flames and the window just bust out. A 50-year-old woman who lived inside the apartment had just called police. She told officers her 15-year-old son had stabbed her. Police say the woman barricaded herself inside another apartment and that her son threatened to set the entire complex on fire. I'm hearing the officers saying, get down, get down. And I'm hearing them telling the neighbors to come out. It's getting the neighbors out, which is like I say, they did a good job. An officer confronted the 15 year old. Police say he charged the officer with a knife in hand. The officer shot him. Paramedics took both mother and son to the hospital. I just read that they didn't kill him because they could have killed him when he had that knife. I'm just sorry that it went through this level. Family members like Kathy Hayes can't believe what happened. She says this morning's events have shaken the family. Like I said, I hope she pulled through and I hope he get the help that he's, he need. Cause he don't need to be in jail. He needs help. A morning that sent shockwaves through a close Norfolk family. Norfolk police say the officer has been placed on administrative duty and that that officer is a three year member of the Norfolk Police Department. In Norfolk, I'm Matt Gregory. Tell on your side.